Hi Capricorn, I'm Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot and welcome to the channel. Uh, if you're new, please subscribe and hit the bell, then you'll be notified when I go live. This, um, and thank you very much for my Cyber Angels, those are my steady followers and viewers. I thank you very much uh, with gratitude that you come back each time and support our channel. Without you, it wouldn't be the channel it is. You don't half know how much I appreciate it. Thank you. And please, uh, if you like the video, leave a reaction behind, even if it is just the thumbs up. And I will get back to you because I do answer all the um, re to the reactions and I love to get connected with my cyber angels. If you would like to become a cyber angel, then join us in the live sessions. Okay, and if you click on this button here just in the corner, there is a white button, then it will take you through to the website charliesangeltarot.com and you can have a look around there for the different info that is placed on the website and the reviews and the different um, offers of for readings. I try to accommodate for every single purse and if you can't afford it, then come into the life and get your free cards and see whether it resonates with your question or situation at hand. Okay, Capricorn, this is your reading for March 2020 and we start off in week one. Love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. Well, that is quite true. My mum used to say, take care of yourself, love yourself first, because you cannot love anybody or take care of anybody if you don't do it yourself. You must not forget yourself. That's the message here. Now the card, I'm using the Lenamon, Titania uh, Lenamon cards, and <coughs> you've got the fox. Now every card has got its upside and downside, and the upside of the fox is perhaps you have to cross your T's and dot your I's. In other words, work in detail or detailed. Make sure that you are precise. Take care of you precisely and correctly. The downside is be careful of people that are jealous or sly. There might be somebody in and around you or in around your relationship that's trying to um, be sly or mean. They want to take your partner away if you are partnered up. That could be the issue here. So, be warned, a forewarned is forearmed. So be precise, tell this person, if there is a person, then tell them to back off. That is telling them precisely that you are not taking it, okay? Then in the second week, we have true love. This is the romance of a lifetime. So <clears throat> if you are partnered up, and you have told this person, go away, back off, then you have won the situation because this, your partner is so astounded that you are so magic that you tell the other person that is wanting to take him or her to back off. He loves you for it. He knows and he sees or she sees that you are strong. And that is true love. That is really true love. Or he'll even back you up. Okay? Look at him. He's backing you here, backing you up, saying thank you. I love you. I love this picture for in this reading. He's got your back. And the angels have you, your back and his back. Look at the angel Cupid in the back of him. Lovely. I like it when things come together. Now the Lenamon card is the heart. I didn't sort them out, honestly. So this is true love, the heart is there. 
you belong in their heart and they belong in your heart. That's the best confirmation that you can ever have. If you're not partnered up, then there will be somebody coming in that will be a true love. This could definitely be in the second week because we've got the heart and the true love card. So there could be somebody coming in. And I especially didn't take the Lenamon with the other signs, the Cartomacy signs, the heart, the wands, or the spades, or the clover, because it can be anybody. Like one of the romance cards says, your ideal might differ. So I think that's a very wise, you know, you can't say, I want a knight with shining armor on a white horse, because the horse is a car now, and there's no more shining armor. <laughs> okay, just be realistic and stay realistic. Retreat. It is time to disconnect from your world. If you are partnered up, take time out and make this a um, good time, quality time. Just to make sure that he or she knows that you love them and they love you. Stay away from poisonous environments. And that's what you do when you take time out. You build on your relationship. This is an amazing reading. You have the answer, yes. Will I get a partner? Yes. Somebody, you are coming home. You are feeling safe with this person. You know that you want a long lasting relationship and it is safe. Now the anchor for me means like that those charms that you get in England, you've got the cross, faith, then you've got the heart, love, and then you've got the anchor, hope. So I always look at this card as hope. Yes, you're coming home to a safe haven. And it also means that you are staying there. You're anchored there, okay, within this partnership. And the answer, an answer with this card is yes. Now for the fourth week in um, March, you've got release your ex. If you do meet somebody in the second week, and um, then you, mu you must always release your ex. I know it can be very painful. I've been through it myself, so uh, time will heal. But you must release your ex to make room for the new, otherwise the new cannot come in. There you go. The time has come to clear your energy. Okay, Capricorn. And I'm being drawn to this stone. This stone is a blue, a blue quartz. I don't know. I forgot what it was, but it is the stone of Saint Michael. I got it from the author of the Angel Feather and Michael cards, and I just got drawn to it. Something has to become clear to you, and this is the message that I'm getting from that stone. It's crazy, I know. But I'm used to myself now, and my followers, my faithful followers, are also used to my crazy outspurts or whatever. But this is how it works. I just get messages, boom, 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 and sometimes I can't turn off the waterfall. I know you're most probably saying, get on with the reading, get on with the reading. Well, and this is an extra message for you. It might resonate with one of you or all of you. So I am, uh, I have to tell you that message. So ask Michael for protection. Ask Michael, Archangel Michael, to bring in clarity and truth. Especially if there is, a, and this is what I mean. I, I just, boom, I get drawn to this card again. And this is how it goes, bang, 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 all over the place. But that's a typical Gemini, especially Ask Archangel Michael to let the truth come out and help you to, um, to let you know what, who this is, if there is somebody, okay? Let Archangel Michael bring the truth and clarity and justice. 
so that you can say back off. Thank you, Michael. And you've got the lady here. So um, you could be meeting a lady or you could be meeting a man if you are a lady um, with a feminine sight, with a nurturing sight, with a caring sight and with a loving sight as well as passion. But love is more prominent than passion because love is lasting and we all want a loving, uh, a loving, passionate, nurturing partner. We want to feel cared for and loved. Now we're going on to the Oracle cards and I've only used angel cards. And this is the answer of the angel. There is something better. Yes, there is something better if you can release your ex. The new one will be better. Don't give up hope. Then we have the Archangel Michael card and you've got car protection. You've got a safe journey. And that means that you might be going somewhere and when you go somewhere, even if it's just the supermarket, you might just meet this person. Archangel Michael and his band of angels stand in protection over your car or a loved one's car. Okay, that is the golden card. I know it looks yellow, but it's meant to be the gold. I will go into this card a little bit. The shield is symbolically presented to you by Archangel Michael as a powerful tool of protection. Archangel Michael is extremely vigilant when called on for protection when traveling on the road. He asks that you make him a regular passenger in the car. Even if there's no spare seat, he will sit on the bonnet or roof happily as you click your seatbelt in place. Request Archangel Michael's presence. Maybe even set up with Archangel Michael that he automatically arrives when you when the seat belt clicks in. Visually surround your car or a loved one's car with a solid golden gold cushion of light. Golden light is particularly angelic and a very powerful protective energy. So ask Archangel Michael to come and sit on your bonnet if there is no room in the car or ask him and visualize when you click that seat belt in to be present with you and or a loved one. And the meaning of this journey could also mean traveling in a new direction, a road trip, roadblocks. There might be blocks that you, uh, emotional blocks, Car maintenance might be required, but be careful because it's mercury retrograde. Okay, or new tires required, a new car, a new driver, unexpected delays, signs, signposts, road less traveled. Or you might be going overseas, you might be going on holiday. And you might or because you can go into an other direction. Yes, you will be going on to an other direction, a new start if you let your, uh, your ex go, because you will want to get the new person coming in. And if you've been married for yonks, then it is a road that is less traveled, because you can travel spiritually, but also physically. Well, I know it says a car, but a car, you can take it a little bit further. A car is a, is a vehicle. It's something that get, takes you from A to Z. So perhaps you might go a different way. You weren't faith, you weren't 
um, spiritual and now you're on the spiritual path and you're taking a, a vehicle it could be a book it could be just watching videos on youtube it could be joining a group that makes you travel the spiritual path you might have just taken that so there's different ways of traveling okay now now we have the um angel feather uh, card and the answer is definitely yes so just and i will give you another couple of angels if there are from the um angel feather card and i also they also work with chakras the answer is yes the answer is yes other symbols of um the angels have heard your question and the answer is definitely yes the teal angel feather is represented to you as a symbol of knowledge like i said spiritual uh, you are going forth traveling spiritually up and up and up you want to get to know more you want to join a group that is faithful and trusting and you want to get this togetherness the angels are happy to give you constant reassurance often you may ask the same question over and over again deep down in your heart and soul however you already know the answer but you are not ready to hear it the angels now lead you towards peace and harmony wow there you are you are letting your ex go you're making room you want something new to come in a new person perhaps okay and they're leading you towards harmony and peace the affirmation that you can use when you sit quietly or meditate i have all my questions answered in my world nothing, nothing ever goes wrong in for symbols that you can recognize is other symbols of the teal angel feather wisdom healing aids decision making emotional healing and richness you can wear these crystals you can meditate on the color but you can also wear crystals and you can eat the color like blueberries because that goes more to um, the teal color which is more like a dark form of aquamarine you can wear the color and this is what you call color therapy and bringing to the forefront your manifestation and visualization of what you want you can you uh, you can wear diop dioptase you can wear la mirma and amazonite turquoise emerald and aquamarine and chrysocola chrysocola so have a look on internet on internet okay all these stones associated angels is archangel haniel angel of divine communication assists clearing perception enhances communications with angels and spirit guides guidance with personal revelations visions and angelic synchronicities and angel saril angel of guidance so that i've got a feeling and i don't know why like i said a spiritual journey i think there's more of a spiritual journey for you here i hope you can read that then i'm doing this so that you can note down the um crystals diopetes I think I'd better take a picture and then um, put it in the video if I can. But this camera is not a fantastic camera, 
because it, I can only do it on auto focus. Okay, now we're going on to the next card. So there you've got um, uh, Archangel Michael, that's here, boom. And then you've got Archangel Haniel and Angel Saril. And the last angel is the Angel of Relationships. And it is number 29. I did not sort out these cards. And I know some of you, Capricorn, you would love to know when there will be somebody coming in. It looks as if they are. So long you clear the energy of the X. Number 29 becomes an 11. And so the angels are giving you a doorway. This month could be the month, but make sure you clear the old and so that you can let the new in. You are one of my uh, biggest followers in science. Thank you very much for your thumbs up and your reactions. And you make, you give me, um, by giving me your thumbs up and reactions, I feel appreciated. And I do appreciate all your reactions and that you come into the live sessions and that you watch the videos. Um, it, it means a hell of a lot to me um, because then I know I'm, uh, uh, I'm doing something good and that I'm helping others. Um, I used to be a nurse and I can't anymore because of the two car accidents, but I know I'm supporting and helping you in uh, one way or another by doing this and I love it and that's why I can carry on doing it. Thanks for being here and thanks for sharing the video with family and friends and showing your appreciation. This is my appreciation back to you. I love you cyber angels and if you are a new viewer or a quiet uh, cyber babe then I love you just as much. Thank you. Take care and be blessed and I hope you have a wonderful month. Please join us in the live sessions if you can. Okay, take care and be blessed and please share and like. Ciao, ciao.